What is up, everyone? Welcome back to the episode. I'm just sitting on the floor of my house, but it's another time for Mystery Taco Blocks unboxing. Today is October 31st, 2019, which is Halloween. Um, I have not really done anything, but except I was sleeping instead of really going out and doing anything for Halloween. No parties, nothing. Sleep is fine for me, so whatever. Let's get into this unboxing. All right, guys, let's see what we got here. Here's the card. Right in a shadow, that's annoying. So the first thing we got is the Live Target Hybrid Dream for fourteen forty nine. Got a cotton cord and pencil, Zeman swimming trout trick, ten thousand fish boomer swimmer, deadly w popping cork, and must add elite shad darter jig. So let's start with the Live Target Hybrid Dream. Oh, it's this thing. All right, guys, this is basically just you know. Um, how do I explain it? It's just, it's a shrimp hard bait. It's not a jerk bait. It's not anything. Basically, it's just, you, it's a twitch bait, essentially. You know, cast on the bottom, crawl it near the bottom, hop it, something like that. Imitate just a shrimp, and, you know, Live Target does a really good job of imitating them. So, it's got really good um, pattern. Looks just like real shrimp. Really holographic film inside the middle. So, it really sh gives a good shine. Uh, good job on this lure. Really like using these things. Never caught a fish in one, but I'm sure if I put the hymen, I'd catch one. Next thing guys, the cotton cordon, cotton cordell pencil popper for eight ninety nine. So once again, another striper lure because you know the fall runs coming up, so they're sending out striper lures in their boxes, which is good because I love top water, I love getting striper top water, so it's nice to get another one of these. They sent me uh, a striper top water in the last box. Um, got to throw it around to surf a bit in Rhode Island, didn't catch anything, but actually had a few blows, so that was pretty nice. Really good rattles, for sure would catch something in the midst of a blitz. Next thing we got is the Z-Man Swimming Trout Trick for $5.99. Interesting, the Swimming Trout Trick, that's pretty cool. Um, just a soft plastic swim bait, looks like to be higher quality, you know, that really cool, uh, in Ralph's Shad, that's pretty interesting. It's basically it's just a rib paddle tail swim bait, you know, classic, put it on a jig head, you know what to do with it from there, so that's pretty nice. Next one is the 10,000 fish shimmer swimmer um, for five twenty nine. dollars So, it, it looks like this is a catch kill lure, and um, really interesting, it's a really realistic looking soft plastic. It's a paddle tail swim bait, it's got a holographic film in the middle of it, it's got beaded eyes. Um, so it just imitates, you know, a bait fish really well. Um, yeah, strobe strips there. Yeah, I mean, in my opinion, that really does look realistic. I feel like in um, any kind of situation where you're on fish that are a little finicky, feeding on more natural baits, something like this would really work. Uh, kind of imitates a shad or a mud minnow or something like that. So in the saltwater setting, this would work really nice. Um, I mean, in a creek, it'll just imitate a, a creek chub or whatever. So that's pretty cool. Next thing we got is the Deadly Dudley Popping Cork for four sixty nine. Y'all know what a popping cork is. I love popping corks, actually. Um, I don't use them in saltwater. I actually use them in freshwater. Um, what I do is I tie, I use these for musky. So um, when you have a bait fish on the end of this thing and the bait fish moving around and it rattles, it actually uh, helps attract some musky. I've caught some musky on popping corks and notice they tend to perform a little better than actual bobbers, in my opinion. So it's pretty nice to just attach a leader from here on the hook. So that's pretty cool. And uh, of course, use this in saltwater as well for the inshore stuff. Um, never got to use one actually. Well, I ha I've used one in saltwater, but haven't haven't really caught much because I'm too I'm kind of a noob at inshore saltwater down south. So whatever. And the last thing we got is the Must Elite Shad Darter Jig. Fairly self-explanatory. It's just got this shad darter um, style jig head. Not so much as a shad dart like you'd use for actual shad, but it's got, you know, the triangle um, head shape. This is something you'd use to swim bait on or um, some kind of bait that you want to be, you know, popping in the water. So essentially something like that. You know, that jig heads match up. It's a black color. Um, you know, it's got the nice, uh, like, 4X hooks. So um, you can use these for, like, a wide, wide range of fish. 
just put any soft plastic on the end. Like I said, you're gonna have to pop it. Or, uh, you know, you can just kind of like twitch along the bottom or a swim bait, you know, just reel it in. And something like this will work pretty well. So I always love getting jig heads because I can never have enough of them. All right, guys, that concludes this video. Thank you so much for uh, watching this video. Uh, I'm so out of it because I, I was sleeping all afternoon. I woke up and was like, oh, shit, I got to post a video. So um, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more unboxings, leave, let me now, uh, leave a like down below. Comment something up. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another episode. So thank you for watching. Bye.